Diva Duck. Today was a peaceful, perfect day. Chirp and Peep woke up early, <laughs> ran a race, ate a watermelon, had a seed spitting contest, and then they found a quiet place to sit and watch the sunset. You know what, Peep? The last time we had a peaceful day like this without any sign of quack was the day he got his head stuck in a tree. We didn't even know where he was. And his head was pointy for two whole days. Peep and Chirp rushed to find Quack and make sure his head was okay. Quack, are you okay? Quack! Wait, wait! That's right, uh-huh, uh-huh, a little to the left. <laughs> and now a little to the right. More, more. There! Is that enough logs? Um, boy, um, well, uh, how many is that? 89? Or, uh, I don't know. I, I don't know. What are you doing, Quack? Arranging the seating. <laughs> the seating for my big time concert. Oh, yeah. Do you really need this many seats? Um, no, 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 no. You're right, Chirp. I need more! More logs, Beaver Boy! Aye, aye, Blue Sailor. Ah, oh, it's so great being the boss of a beaver. Hey, you want to know what I'm singing? There's nothing like a duck. All 57 verses. It'll be classic. That's what you sang at your last concert. Exactly! Here, I'll give you a preview. There's nothing like a duck. You can look, but you won't have any luck. Because like I just told you, there's nothing like it. Mm. Oops, I forgot. My vocal coach wants me to rest my voice. Vocal rest. Squirrel is your vocal coach? Of course! Every great singer needs a couple. Quack's vocal coach was firm. Quack had to rest down in his pond and not speak at all. He had to save his strength and his voice for the concert. But I have to talk. Ducks have to talk. It's what they do. Quack finally agreed. He would stay in his pond and not say another word until concert time. Have you ever had to stay in a pond and not talk? Trust me, it's hard. Quack was bored and hungry, but then help arrived. Pee! Hi, Quack. Were you calling me? Did you want something? What? Quack wanted an acorn, but how to tell that to Peep? I don't know what that means. You want an acorn? You want another acorn? Okay, I'll go find one. This was very exciting. Quack had managed to talk to Peep without talking. By late afternoon, Quack had worked out a duck code, and Peep was explaining it to Chirp. Since Quack can't talk or leave his pond, he figured out another way to tell us what he needs. Three slaps means, come here. A gargle 
Minty wants an acorn. <laughs> two gargles. Minty wants two acorns. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Minty wants a raspberry. Achoo. And a sneeze means you can go now. You remember all that? Uh huh. And that means bring me an acorn and a raspberry, then go to my bush, get a stick, hurry back as fast as you can, and tickle my feet. I will never remember all that. Peep decided to write down the duck code so Chirp would remember it. Two, three means Quack wants us to come to the pond. The squiggle means a gargle noise, which means Quack wants an acorn. The circle is a, which means he wants a raspberry. Finally, the duck code was all written down. I think I've got it. Should we do a test? <laughs> That's a gargle. And a gargle means an acorn. Quack wants an acorn. Right. Do you really want an acorn? <laughs> That's a... <laughs> which means... You want a raspberry. Where do you get the raspberries? There's a bush over by the tree next to the rock that's near the flower. Got it! Quack just loved being the boss of a chicken and a red bird. He kept them busy all day and part of the night. Hmm. <laughs> Another raspberry? That makes 37 raspberries. How do I get out of this? I don't know. Maybe we should... Rain! It's raining! I love rain! Well, not really, but... Bye, Quack! Gotta go! It's raining! A duck. If you ever get stuck, you'll need a duck to get you out of being stuck. Here comes verse 57. In a pond, there's a lot Even though it was still raining on concert day, Quack sang all 57 verses of There Is Nothing Like a Duck, and it only took two hours. Cause there is nothing. Here we go, big finish. Like a duck. Clapping isn't in the duck code, but it's a sign that you liked something. And even if you didn't like something, it's the polite thing to do. Thank you, thank you. Next time, we'll fill those seats. I can tell you that much. Yes, thank you. You're too kind. Do you want an encore? Are you sure? Really?